let's say you're crafting with limited assets, either solo self found or early league, and you get this, this um, eye level 85 fractured bow. It has an additional arrow. Ideal would be two additional arrows, but this is all you got. Let's say you farmed up all this stuff here. First thing is to turn it rare with a regal, and then use perfect fossils, just a couple, to get the quality up. Now we want to go ahead and use some essences. We're guaranteeing more crit because the base of this is high crit. We're trying to max and stack our crit above 9% on the base. And then we keep the bow attacks, fire additional arrow. I was rolling here for attack speed, so we got our attack speed. Now we do suffixes cannot be changed. It costs two divines, which can be farmed. Um, and now we hit it with a Veiled Chaos. Now before you unveil with June, I'm always reminded all the time, you have to go in, you want to block it, you want to maximize your chance to get the unveil you want. We're going to craft on a low level Damage Penetrates Chaos Reds, because that's not what we want. And we got pretty nice increased physical damage. We were hoping for Blind or Impale, but we'll take Poison on hit. Now of course we want to go in, we want to block again. We want to block with a Junk Mana mod, that prefix, because we're going to do an Old Fashioned Exalt Slam. You cannot use Conqueror Orbs on a Fractured Item. We got a really good one. We got adds chaos damage. Uh, tier 1 adds chaos damage. Really nice. Synergizes with the poison well. Now we want to craft on additional physical damage to replace uh, for what we really want. And there you have it. A nice bow to use for solo self-found or early league for yourself.